What's good, Galactic God channel? This is Christian Tim Innovation Yu Gi Oh! And on my channel, I do three types of videos I do general discussions, top tens, and I do an explain series by explaining decks and archetypes in detail. And today, I'm going to bring, bring you guys a little discussion topic. And the topic's going to be pretty much about everyone bitching and complaining that pendulums are bad for the game. So, without further ado, let's begin. Starting off by saying, oh my god, pendulums are bad for the game. Pendulums are killing Yu-Gi-Oh! Konami, what the fuck? I'm just sitting here like, bro, these people that are bitching that pendulums are bad for the game sound like the fucking old people that are saying down with the internet. Like, seriously. F for the first part, Yu-Gi-Oh! in general is always going to have something broken. From the original era to, with the 2000 attack, 1900, 1800, beast stick monsters to... Pendulum summoning, well not pendulum summoning, but till synchro summoning, XYZ summoning, etc. We've always had broken mechanics. Some people argue that back in the day that synchro summoning was gonna kill the game. What are you right? No. Synchro summoning came out, the game had it ups and downs, had a broken tier one deck, then the game went to the future of XYZ era. XYZ era came, everyone was screaming, oh my god, the XYZs are so broken, oh my god. It's like synchro summoning, but a lot easier. It's gonna kill a game. Did it kill a game? No. So I'm just like, okay, while I, I do agree with the fact that pendulums can be a little bit too broken in time, is it any different from the previous mechanics that we received that was just pretty much shitting on everyone? No, it is not. No, it is not. I mean, yes, you set up your scale, you pendulum summon, and if your opponent don't have the solemn strike or they don't have a card to out you, you're going to pretty much win the game because you're going to flood the field and just overlay and attack the game. But at the same damn time, it's like, what was Konami supposed to do? What would you guys have liked them to do? They have to keep the game fresh. If you don't keep the game fresh, the game's going to get boring and people are going to quit, which will make the game die. Konami's a business, and me doing a little business studying and doing marketing studying, that's what I was, that's what I was going to school for was marketing that... You have to keep things fresh in order to keep it interesting. So I'm pretty sure Konami has a little st statistic guy who looks at the trends in Yu-Gi-Oh! And, and see what's better for the game. And every time the game gets a little dry, they revamp it with something different, giving, it, giving them themselves that two to three year time span to introduce fresh mechanics into the game. So they have to change it up every while to keep the game interesting, or if not, the game would die. Great example of that would be a game I used to play called Battle Spirits that was an amazing game for when it came out, but the game stayed the same for the first four sets, and the game had an increase of players, and it just dipped down below. So, in short, guys, while you guys might, be, might not be fans of the Pendulum era, it is definitely not going to kill the game. And two, three years from now, you guys are going to be playing into a new mechanic, and you're going to be saying that new mechanic is killing the game, and you're going to be looking back at Pendulums, XYZs, Synchros, and saying to yourself, damn, those mechanics weren't that bad. So... What do you guys think about this topic? Let me know in the comment section down below. I want to give a big thanks to Galactic God for allowing me to get through this guest upload on this channel. And if you guys enjoyed this video, come over to my channel. I'm pretty sure the link will be in the description below to watch more of me. So, like I tell my viewers, I do these videos. I truly believe in helping you guys become better players. And also do these videos. I truly believe in you guys helping me become a better player. Christmas Innovation signing out. Peace, guys. Stay innovative. Deuces. So, slash trap or effect while this card is in your graveyard, except during the damage step. You contribute one spell to cast a type monster, add this card from your hand. Add this card to your